it just me, or is the best time of the day when the kids are in bed? It's like, I don't even want to do anything but go lay down. Or eat in peace. (laughs) Oh. It was a long day. I love summer vacation and I love having our babies home. But also, (laughs) I'm really looking forward to the fall. And not just because it's my favorite season. Although, I'm really psyched about that too. The back to school shopping, Halloween costumes are going to be coming out soon. I love it. Oh, look, I can use my phone for five seconds without Leland grabbing for it. Do you have one of those screen wipes over there? Like the little cloth? Because he has got his sticky hands all over this thing. I can't even see through it. It won't even pick up my passcode. Which, by the way, I had to change the other day thanks to your genius evil daughter. How does she know how to hack me? She's nine. Oh my god. It's going to be weird though. Leland's going to be in full days for the first time. First grade. I'm not going to have anybody here at the house with me. It's going to be lonely. Do you ever have those moments where like, your brain just zooms out and you're like, I can't believe this is my life. Like, I can't believe that I'm laying in bed with my spouse. I used to think I would never get married. Never even fall in love. And then there you are. And we've got kids. Two of them. We did that twice. It's crazy. Don't you think? Is that what you think when you look over here at this side of the bed? You're like, never thought I would marry her. (laughs) I'm just kidding. Kind of. (sighs) I'm happy, though. You know, for a while there, I had this whole, like, screw the world plan. This was after a breakup. (laughs) I figured if no one wanted to marry me or have a family with me. I mean, those are two things that have just been ingrained in me my whole life. Growing up sucked. Family life sucked. My parents' marriage. My relationship with everyone in my family. I was a little crumpled up piece of trash. No, this is a metaphor. You uncrinkled me. But for a minute there, I thought I was going to stay just like that. Damaged and bad at loving and lonely. I actually signed up to be a foster mom. Yeah. Well... All my friends were having kids and like this wasn't even the age anymore where oh they're starting to have babies like they already had families and I was still not even seeing someone seriously every time something new would start we would break up I just got to this point where I was like I don't need anyone then and I wanted a family And I didn't want to wait for someone to give that to me. I couldn't count on it. But I knew what I wanted. I wanted to be part of back to school and Halloween costumes and being really excited to go to bed because the kids are finally leaving you alone. I always wanted that. I didn't think I'd ever have it with somebody. Yeah, because I'm a trash ball. (laughs) I meant it affectionately. 
Yes, there is such a thing. Mm -hmm. I was just going to foster on my own. And I was always open to that changing, I guess, in the back of my mind, like it did. But I also started to think I'm just not going to wait on anybody. Never again. I was going to have my own kids and be a mom anyways. Through foster care. It's kind of sad, though. I just think I could have done a lot of good. Loved a lot of little ones. Bought backpacks for a lot of kids. Tucked them in. Cut up apples for their lunch boxes. I'm sure there's other people doing it for them. But still, I feel sad for anyone who doesn't have someone. Because that's exactly who I was for most of my life. Until I met you. Anyway, the blue tie that's hanging on your closet door, is that the one you want it to wear tomorrow? Because I'm pretty sure it still has a stain on the bottom part of it, and I don't think we were able to get it out last time. But I know you have the gray and blue tie in the closet that is that going to work. If not, you might need to rethink your outfit before bed. Do you want me to go look in the laundry? Wait, wait for what? What's wrong? Are you okay? Why are you looking at me like that? Yes. Jada's nine. <laughs> I do know how Leland is going into first grade. Why? Did you forget? Are we just reviewing the facts or what? I, I don't follow. What are you talking about? You have an idea. <laughs> what? Yes, I am aware that we have four bedrooms in this house. Why? Did you like suddenly get amnesia? Do we need to go over all the facts of our life? Should I get the photo album? <laughs> Another kid? Um, I thought we talked about this. After all of Leland's health stuff, we weren't going to get pregnant again. Remember? What is that look on your face? Okay, you have an idea. <laughs> what is it? <laughs>